Let's roll. Okay. Danielle. No, my makeup, my makeup oh, wait, artist and my hairdresser is fixing my hair. Is that good? Oh. Yeah. My 10 year old. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's good. Okay, thanks. I got caught in the rain. Is it raining out there? I, I thought it never rained in Southern California. It was been pouring for like the last two weeks, which is exactly the time that I have to move. <laughs> your luck. That's always the case, though. Yeah. But hey, you're coming home. How does it feel? I'm so, I'm so ready, you guys. I am beyond excited. Um, I'm all packed up and um, we're ready to go. Like, it's just like two more days, if that, like a day and a half, ready to jump on that plane. Um, and, and just make it back to you guys, my parents and my brother and all the cousins, you know, they're all waiting for us. It's going to feel so good to know that you're going to be able to do what you love at a station mm -hmm. that is already family and be around your family. Yeah, no, absolutely. I mean, I've been dreaming about like spending time and living day to day with my family for years, like since I left and, um, you know, I didn't ever really want to leave Houston. Like Houston was my hometown. I was living my dream working at KPRC and like serving Houston and working there. But you know, in our career, many times you have to leave, get a lot of more experience and I'm ready to come home. And with this opportunity to work with all you guys again, is just a dream come true. And of course the cherry on top is I get to see my nieces, my nephews, my cousins, my parents and my brother and my sister-in-law and just, you know, make memories together and um, just ex re-explore Houston because because every time I go, it is so different. It is huge. Um, there are a lot of really cool restaurants that I want to discover. So make that list for me and we'll go together. <laughs> you are a Houston area girl. You are from this area, raised here. Remind us uh, where, you're from, where you're from and just, just the roots that you have here. Yeah, so I was born less than a block from KPRC at Memorial Southwest Hospital right there behind you guys. Wow. And um, I grew up in Sugarland, Texas. I went to elementary, middle, and high school there. And I went to the University of St. Thomas uh, in Houston. And so I was a commuter every day. And then I started working there. And it, I just have so many amazing memories about living there, growing up there. It has been such uh, an amazing thing to be Texan, to feel Texan, to leave and continue feeling Texan and come back. They say you can take a girl out of Texas, but you can't take Texas out of a girl. I believe that. What, what, are, you, what are you looking forward to, to experiencing the most on a daily basis since you've been gone? But you know, I, I know you come back and you get tastes of it, but what are you looking most forward to, to, to experiencing once you move back? Well, the first thing I want to do is just like really hug my family and spend a couple of days with them, like just like loving on them, you know, with COVID and everything, we've been separated longer than usual. We haven't been able to see each other. So it's really just connecting with them and then uh, connecting with some of the people that uh, I used to work with, you know, like you guys and some of our um, our friends that, that that live there, too. And so once I've done that, I have just a couple of days to do that then I'm excited to get to work because there's a lot of work to do in Houston and I want to get back in the community. Um, I've always loved doing community work there and um, just reconnect also with some of our viewers. I know that I'm sure you guys have a lot of new viewers. There are a lot of new Houstonians there and getting to hear and know what's important to them and what I can do to serve them and to serve the community as well. Danielle, I know that I wasn't here when you were at KPRC years ago, but we did have a chance to hang out in Tokyo together for the Olympics. <laughs> I know what yes. our experience is like, but tell the viewers what it was like for you when you were in Tokyo covering the Olympics. Oh, we hung out. We had a good time, <laughs> didn't we? Yeah, we did. Um, man, going to the Olympics was so different this time. Keith, remember when we were in Rio, um, it was just like party in, in Rio. It was a party everywhere, music, dancing. And with COVID in the middle of a pandemic, to see how they pull that off and these elite athletes performed at the highest level with so much pressure, um, it was just amazing to see. I think it was just incredible to see how Tokyo, um, the Japanese people there and, and our athletes and all of us came together and be united by the love of sports and that passion. And I thought that was pretty awesome that they pulled that off. Uh, we're so happy to have you back. We know your family is going to yeah. be so grateful to have you back as well. Oh, guys, thank you so much. I feel so honored to be a part of KPRC again. I actually never feel like I left, you know. It's just always been a part of me. And I still have all the cards and the pictures that... Um, so many of my coworkers gave me when I left, and so I was, and I had it on my desk here. And as I was packing up my desk, I'm like bringing it back. 
It's, it's, it's so cool. You guys already do some incredible work. So I'm excited to be, become a part of that, to work alongside you and to serve our community and the great people of Houston as well. We will be here to welcome yeah. you home. Safe travels and we can't wait to see you, Daniela. Thank you guys. Take care. It's so good to see you again. We're going to have to have a Tokyo reunion when I get back. Oh, without a doubt. Some ramen. Little, little sake on the side. Yeah, but without, the, yeah, without having that. to do the laundry in the bathtub. Yes. Oh, gosh. I think it was you Daniela was like, look, at, I got actual like laundry detergent. That was you, right? You told me that you did your laundry in the, the bathtub? Yeah, in the bathtub. Yeah. I was like scrubbing. I took a and, note from you um, did that. It was so tough, fun. man. That really brought out like the domestic side of me. If we can do that, we can do anything. Without a doubt. We can't wait to see you. Danny. Yeah. All right, guys. Good to see you. Take care. Happy Take New care. Year. Okay, you Happy as well. New Thank year. You. you as well.